Hi everyone, my name's Michael, Michael Dance. Let me run you through the best gosh darn team you've ever seen in your gosh darn life. Let me just run you through, run you through what we got going on. Now you see, you might be thinking, old kit, what's this, what's this, what's this? I'll tell you what's that, this is next level football boys, next level football. Now, have you ever seen a team try and disguise themselves in the grass? No, you haven't. With this kit, no one will see us coming until bam, it's too late. We got the ball back of the net. The third kit there, that's the All Blacks. Quite often, a lot of our players die. So we have to have a, like a funeral kit we wear after they die. It's very important. As you see there, we're Mike's Tykes. Because my name is Michael Dance. And these are my Tykes, nicknamed the Tykes. Now, we can't afford a proper ground. So we play in the graveyard in Trowbridge, in our wheelchair because that's the only place where we've got the open field and no one shouts at us for playing on the football there. Yeah, we've destroyed a few gravestones, but, you know, you've got to break a couple of eggs to make some football. There we are. Our reputation is obscure, but we've got excellent facilities. We've got an un un unusually large bank balance. See, this is our relationships. Unfortunately, our rifle club is Israel. Now, now I know what you're thinking. Nothing to do with that. We just get heavily involved in the Israel-Palestine conflict. As you see, we don't have any favourite people. We don't dislike anyone. Edit affiliations. We're teamed up with Palestine. See, we find it really important in football to really sort of take a, take a stand on the Israeli-Palestine conflict. And that's why we've done that there. Say, so, nothing against Jewish people. Nothing against any of those people. We've just taken that stand. Right, now we've got to choose our, our dream squad. Now, the first person, obviously, we're going to choose is me. Michael Darts. It's me, Michael Darts. It's Michael Darts, which is me. The sort of team we got going here, boys, is top notch. It's top notch. Obviously, obviously, we got me boy Darty, Michael Darts. He's the lead guy. He's the top guy. He knows what he's doing. He's good. Look at all those stats. They're probably quite good. He's a giant. The man's a giant. And he, and he floats away in the wind. That's how you know he's good. He's got a special plan. Whereas they tie a string to his legs. When it gets really windy, and he goes up like a kite. And he just carries the ball at his feet and he just sort of kicks it in from the air. It's not illegal. They've not written a rule against it. That's why he's so good. Look at all this he's got going on. He, he, he's a top player. He's an absolute top player. What have we got going on? Obviously, it's, it's Mike's Tykes. It's Michael Darts. It's his whole family. It's his whole bloody family. So you've got all his sons. Grover Darts, Michael Junior Darts, John Darts, Harry Darts, Lenny Darts, Jenny Darts, Oliver Darts, Russell Darts, Peter Darts, Judas Darts, and Sam Darts. They make up the under 21s team. And you got all his brothers. Di, Nigel Darts, Connor Darts, Craig Darts, Lee Darts, Young Darts. They call it Young Darts because he's only 38. The rest of them, he's only 37. The rest of them play four years old. He's a bloody young one. You've got James Darts, Jay Darts, Nick Dark, and Harvey Darts. It's going to be a solid team. It's going to be a real solid team. Now, managerial style. Managerial style. Now, you see, we've got a lot of youngsters on my team. Got a lot of youngsters on my team, but they need to fend for themselves. They need to fend for themselves. We can't be we can't be raving them. Tactical, none of that. It's mental games. It's all mental games. That's what it is. Tactical, no, 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 no. Fit, no. How you win? How you really win is you play a defensive game. You bore them to death, and you never attack. That's what you do. That's how you win a game. Play football. We don't need to worry about tactics. We just want to play some play football. We just want to play some play football. So. Let's see, we've got Dart, he's a goal kicker because he's 15 foot tall. We've got Grover. Let's see, we've got Grover, is uh, I don't know. Mind control. We've got, uh, they're all doctors on this team. They're all bloody doctors. We are sort of, that's how you make a bloody team. That's how you make a bloody team. All right. Now I've got my squad. My squad's all set up. Oh, we've got a bloody, bloody football match with bloody Shen Yua. Oh, bloody shit. She's always coming down to Trowbridge in Wiltshire. I don't know. Wherever they're bloody from. Whatever here. We've, got some, we've, we've already, before our first match, Mike Starks has got some bloody issues to address. Right. First one. Team cohesion. The team's collective mental state is extremely disappointing at the moment. And that's a shame. That's a big bloody shame. Yeah. We've got 40-year-olds. And then we've got 14-year-olds. <laughs> and they're all playing the same bloody game of football. Yeah. we got that. What's that bloody matter? What's that bloody matter? It's a game of bloody football. This will significantly impact player positioning during matches. It's fine. Players will experience significant issues with their vision and reactions to events on final playing. Well, that's fine. There are many players who speak different languages. Well, yeah. Michael Darts doesn't speak any language. 
He doesn't speak English. He doesn't speak any language. He's he's the, they call him the mute captain. He doesn't speak, but he can give her a bloody shot. Uh, what have we got? So passionate, cautious, calm. He's going to do it cautiously. He's going to say, I wanted to take the opportunity to introduce myself to you as the new Mike's Tykes manager. He's going to do that. Cautious. I think we can't finish mid-table this season. <laughs> I'm sensitive to the opinion of the room and if there's a general feeling that we should be finishing the top half of the table as there appears to be then we should end that, it's too positive I'm just managing expectations <laughs> he's coming in he's crapping on everyone cautious this is exactly uh, ex expectations still acceptable expectations still lacking ambition Darty, Darty, Michael Darts is saying I can't think of anything to say John Darts I still don't think you're saying it's a high enough target given the squad we've got here. That's exactly the sort of reaction I was looking for. That was exactly the sort of reaction I was looking for, boys. I came in. I came in. I saw you were all disappointed. I wanted to kick you down to the ground further. That I've made everyone mad. Fantastic. That's me. That's what I do. Michael Darts. Oh, I've got to attend a bloody meeting. Welcome to Tykes. I'd like to take a few minutes of your time to welcome you to the club. I also want to assure you have the full backing of the board. We wouldn't have hired you if you didn't feel the right... Great, let's get this meeting started. I'm really looking forward to working with this club and achieving big things. Also appreciate you taking the time on your busy schedule, meeting me in person. Mike's Tykes might be a young club, but I can send you an overview of your history and inbox if you'd like. No. As was mentioned in your welcome message, this club has no philosophies which will be judged during your time at the club. Would you like to arrange a meeting to suggest philosophies you're passionate about for the board to consider approving? I have some philosophies. It's traditional style of press conference. I think I think we should hold a press conference. Calmly, yes, I think it would be good for me to meet the journalists and give the fans a chance to see me in action. Look at his bloody face. Great. Fantastic. Bloody f f great. Right. Oh. Oh, it's a bloody game. This game's coming. Oh. D Mike Tykes faced an uncertain start of a new season following reports that left-back Lee Darts could be sidelined. What's he bloody... Do we, haven't, we haven't even... Bloody Lee Darts... <laughs> The 40-year-old went down in agony. And it's him. Oh, bloody fire him. I'm going to fire him. I'm just going to fire him. Where's the fire button? I'm going to fire him. Lee Darts. Lee, come on, Lee Darts. Transfer. <laughs> offer him up. <laughs> come on, I don't want him. Someone else bloody take him. Oh, his feet. Nothing, just take him. <laughs> just bloody walk away with him, boys. <laughs> just bloody, bloody walk a bloody way with him, boys. I don't bloody want him. Bloody someone take him. That's what you get. When you injure yourself in my bloody game, that's what you bloody get. That's what you bloody get. Talk to darts about injury. It's uh, cautious. Just leave me to it. I don't need your sympathy. Well, no, that. Look, likely talking points. My new job, relationship with the board, Darty, me, Michael Darts, transfer policy, management style. Journalists expected. One, press conference location, the graveyard. Right, let's go. Uh, <sighs> Hi, Michael. What are your initial thoughts on uh, taking the Mike Tykes job? I'm very excited. I can't wait to get stuck in. I don't wish to <laughs> I don't wish to look, boys. I don't want to. I don't want to talk about this. I don't want to talk about this at all. Do you feel the expectations asking you this season have been fair and realistic? It's, it's not my. Can I write? What's attracted you to Mike's Tykes? I am not, and have never. There's a storm out, but <laughs> there's a storm. I've realised that. Hi, Michael. What do you think about this club? I don't want to talk about that. All right, but what about uh, no? That's that's a private matter. I don't want to talk about that either. Uh, what attracted you to this club? I'm bloody storming out. I'm bloody storming out. I didn't sign up for this. I didn't. I didn't bloody sign up for this. Uh, none of that. That's not what I'm about. 
Right, it's the bloody big bloody day, boys. It's the bloody big bloody day. Bloody big bloody day. And we're not wearing our funeral kit. We're not in a bloody funeral kit. It's not a bloody funeral day, boys. This should be in our away kit. Ah. Oh. Oh, no, it's just Dye. He's a goalkeeper. Okay, fine. Just Dye. He's in his, his goalkeeper kit. Uh, right. Go to the bloody dressing room. Most of the players look far from interested in listening to you despite the fair atmosphere overall. That's fine. That's fine. Team talk. <laughs> I'm going to go in aggressively. <laughs> I'm going to go in aggressively and say I've got nothing specific to say. <laughs> a few of the players reacted negatively to the comments. I'm going to end the team talk. <laughs> Kick off. Let's play some fucking football. <laughs> That's Michael Darts, by the way. <laughs> right. Boys, now you see we've got some good plays going on. Right, here we are. Here we are, boys. Here we are. Right, now come on. Come on, Greens. Come on, Greens. Yes. It's my boys here. It's Mark, they're doing great. The bloody... They're doing great. They're doing great. <laughs> Guys, there's no pressure, don't worry about it. Oh, God. oh, there we are. Beautiful play by Darts Jr. Maddox is coming in, but... Oh. Come on, what are you doing there, Darty? Darty, come on. You should have saved that. Right. Right, he's playing, boy. Come on, Darts Jr. Oh, he, he scored a goal last time. We can't let... Tackle him. Tackle him. Tackle him. Oh, they've stopped me from shouting. <laughs> right, this... Come on. Just tackle him. <laughs> tackle him. Tackle him. Do a bloody tackle. Go on, young Darts. Go ahead, Darts Jr. He's, darts Jr. has got it. And we got... The other du darts, come on, do do something. <laughs> come on, boys, that's it, boys. Right now, do do go over the goal, do the goal. Oh, it's a good look at that play. Look at that play. Oh, go on, that, that, that. Interesting choice. Go on. Oh, it's going to be a goal. That's not a goal. Go on, go on, go on, every darts. Ah, oh, solid play, boys. Sorry, I'm going to shout. Solid play. Why they they've stopped me shouting? Oh yeah, uh, solid play. Demand more. There we are. We did good. We did good. All right. Oh, here we are. Here we are, boys. Here we are. Let's go on. Tackle him. Tackle him. You know they're waiting. There was the help. Oh, he fell over. He bloody fell over. Oh yeah. Ref. Bloody, bloody ref. Look at him. That was nothing. That was bloody nothing. Nah. Bloody ref. Okay, out of the dressing room. I'm going to give him a team talk. I'm going to aggressively say... I've got nothing to say. I'm going to go in. I'm going to go, boys. I've got nothing to say. Nothing specific to say right now. Let's just keep this going in the second half. That's what I'm going to say. And then... And then I'm going to tell everyone to calm down. And I'm going to... And I'm going to tell everyone to calm down. I'm going to tell everyone to calm down and I'm going to storm out of there. They look far from inspired. Well, it's their fault. Right, let's play some bloody football. Play some bloody football. Right, go on. Lovely. Now, yeah, do, do the... Do, oh, go on, darts. Go on. Go on, Harry, darts. Oh, beautiful pass. Beautiful pass. Darts Jr. Back to Harry, darts. Oh, that was a foul. Definitely a foul. Come on, ref. Here we are, boys. Here we are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, go on. Go on, go on, mate. Oh, beautiful save. Beautiful save. Oh, beautiful save. It's a bloody beautiful save. Right. Go on. Go on. Go on, Nigel Darts. Nigel Darts. Harry Darts. Back to Nigel Darts. He's passing it back to Harry Darts. Who's giving it to Jay Darts? There we are. Oh, Cheltenham have got it, which is not good. 
Maddox Dart, that's not, that's a different team. Alright. Gotta tackle him. Tackle him. Tackle him. Tighten up. Poor show. Poor bloody show. Poor bloody show. Focus after the. What are they? What? Come on, boys. Come on. Go on, boy. Go on, get game. Go on, boys. Go on. Go on, tackle him. Bloody tackle him, boys. Go on, bloody. Go on, go on, go on, bloody. I need some encouragement. Oh, I can't do that. No, no, no. Just go on, boys. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Bloody disgrace. They're all getting transferred. They're all getting bloody transferred after this. Go on, go on. Grab the darts, heavy darts. It's a solid attempt. That's... I mean, that was the plan overall. If you, if you weaken them enough by f for firing the balls at them, they can't play football very well. This is the plan. It's... The thing about these boys is they come from a very different game. They come from a very, very bloody different game, don't they? Very different bloody game. Go on, go on. There we are, boys. There we are. Tackle him. T tackle, tackle him. Bloody t t tackle. Bloody tackle him. T bloody, t bloody tackle him, boys. Bloody play some bloody. Play some bloody football, boys. Even though our goalkeeper is 15 foot tall, he still can't bloody dive out of bloody way. He's getting transferred. I know it's Michael Darts. He's the he's the reason this team exists. And to be fair to him, he's not very good at football. Look, what's that? What's that? Look, we've got 10 minutes left, boys. Four goals in 10 minutes. Four goals in 10 minutes. You can do it. Come on, boys. You can score four goals in one minute. <laughs> we bloody Mike's Tykes. Go on, boys. You can you can do this. We can score four goals in 45 seconds. You can bloody do it. We bloody Mike's Tykes. <sighs> Come on, boys. <sighs> you can bloody do it. <laughs> yeah, we are, boy. And bloody foul, that was. Bloody foul. And bloody foul, that was. Bradley Waller from Football 365. I predicted a win for Mark's Tykes today, and maybe could have seen Cheltenham snatching a draw, but I certainly didn't see the Robins winning this one. I'm still struggling to believe that the manager really meant to play Darty early to play Darty in goal. Listen here. Listen here. This is a message for you, Bradley Waller from Football 365. He's a blessed bloody goal. People be bloody got. He's a blessed bloody goal. People be bloody got. You best believe it otherwise, boy. You best bloody believe it. Better the dressing room. Most players look far from interested in listening to you. Team talk. Aggressive. I've got nothing specific to say. <laughs> Boys, I've got nothing specific to say to you right now. See you next week. That's what's happened. Boys. Boys, we might carry this on another time. Right, Mike's Tykes need a bloody rest. I hope you've enjoyed this, boys. I hope you've enjoyed this. And this continuing adventure of Mike's Tykes, the best football team in the old gosh darn world. Uh, see you soon.